In this problem, we're going to solve the inequality and then graph the solution and write the solution set in an interval notation. So the goal here is to isolate x. Let's go ahead and do it. So first you'll notice there's a 2 fifths here uh, being multiplied by 2x minus 1. So to get rid of it, we can multiply both sides by the reciprocal, which is 5 over 2. So I'll put a 5 over 2 on the left and a 5 over 2 on the right. So these 2's cancel and the 5's cancel. And so we're left with 2x minus 1 greater than over here, we can actually, um, the 2 goes into the 10 5 times. And so we end up with 5 times 5, which is 25. So now that we've kind of freed it from the parentheses, we can add 1 to both sides. Again, the goal is to isolate the x. So we have 2x greater than 26. Then we just go ahead and divide by 2, divide by 2. So we end up with x greater than 13. So that would be um, one answer, one way to answer the inequality. It's all of the x's bigger than 13. So to graph the solution, what you can do is you take the number 13 and you plot it on a number line. And so all the numbers bigger than 13 are over here on the right because they're bigger. So you just go ahead and you shade that in. I'm going to use a different color like this. Good stuff. And because it's a greater than, we have a parentheses, and the parentheses always faces the shading. So that would be the graph of the solution set. And that's it. I hope this video has been helpful. Oh, uh, an interval notation. Almost forgot. <laughs> it's parentheses, just straight from the picture, 13, and it goes all the way to infinity. And that would be it. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.